Let us make this very dynamic model of transforming triangles. Take a A4 size paper sheet, fold it to half. Make it a square by making length and breadth equal. Now fold it to half. Further fold the two halves into halves. Square is divided into four parts. Do this from the other side also. In this way our square is divided into 16 equal squares. Now open this sheet, you will get grid of 32 squares. Make the folds clear and straight by using your nails. Now remove the two strips of 4 squares from the shorter side. Now we have 24 square left. Fold the sheet from the middle using pencil mark 3 lines, 1 from the open end, end at the center fold and 2 from the closed end on the side folds as shown. Now cut, the, these, cut these 3 lines. And open the model. Cut the middle 2 squares. In this way you will get a window. Open the shutter, join the edges of the center of two squares to the extreme edges using tape. Do this for both the sides. Now bring the extreme edges of top and bottom to the center fold and join using a transparent tape. Do this for both the sides. In this way you will get two triangular pipes having eight, eight equilateral triangular prisms. Now to close this prism, make, take another sheet, make square grid of 32 triangles and cut 16 triangles from it. Now watch this part very carefully. Take one square. And fold it to half make a crease and open it now bring one corner on the midline and make a straight slanted crease to the other corner Do the same for the other corner also.
in this way you will get a equilateral triangle now fold the sheet from the top along the top vertex of the triangle when you fold the sheet along the sides of triangle you can see a equilateral triangle with two flaps make 16 such triangles now using glue fix these triangles into the prism and do the same for all the six all the eight prisms now your model is almost ready and this is the complete model with this model you can play for hours make number of interesting mathematical patterns hexagon rhombus house bridge etc and you can show it in your maths project also